tough loss here at the Kohl Center. The Wisconsin Badgers, they lose 80 to 70 to the Tennessee Volunteers, ranked number nine in the nation. Really, this one was, it wasn't a tale of two halves, but the first half you look at it, the Badgers gave up 43 points. Tennessee shooting over 60%, over 50% from three. That's something that the Badgers just can't allow defensively. Greg Gard acknowledged it after the game. That's something they'll look to improve on, but they were in it. They scored 35 points in the first half and really remained in it up until maybe the four minute mark or so when Tennessee pulled away with the 64, or 64 to 56 lead and really kept it at about eight points. You're looking at this game, I mean, Dalton Connect was, he, he's hes a talented, talented scorer. I mean, he showed that today, 24 points. Really, the Badgers tried a lot of different looks. They threw Max Klesman at him, threw Connor Resigian at him, even threw some of the bigger guys, A.J. Storr and uh, also Tyler Wall. But they were undisciplined at times, going through the screens, going through the different motions off the, off the ball. And these different issues caused the Badgers, obviously, costed them. Connect's also a good scorer. He's gonna he's gonna be able to power up and score over certain players. He's gonna be able to get you know certain shots off inside the in the inside the two point range. So good game for him. Uh, elsewhere, I mean, you look at the Badgers offensively. AJ Store led the team with 17 points, but it came on 20 shots. I think shot selection definitely will be a question. It seemed like he tried to force his shot a little earlier. They're trying to be aggressive, and it's good that the Badgers set the tone by being aggressive there, but I think, you know, when you look at some, some of the shots, there were certainly better opportunities probably the Badgers could have gotten elsewhere in the shot clock, so that's something that, you know, uh, the Badgers will have to look at offensively, but they shot 41%, only shot 25 from three, and still scored 70 points. They could have scored 79 points if they had hit all their free throws. Go 14 to 23 from the free throw line. So I think there's certainly a lot of positives, given that it's game two for the Badgers. Um, I think that there's definitely a lot to look at for this team. But they lose. They go drop to one and one. And now they go ahead and face Providence on the road this upcoming week. It's going to be a fun matchup. Badgers will look to try and get their first marquee win off the books. So tough loss for the Badgers. But... Stay tuned for all the content on Bucky Smith Quarter. We're going to be putting up Greg Gard's interview. We're going to be putting up all the different things that players said and also a lot more tonight and tomorrow. 